Yeah, yeah, what's poppin'? It's your boy Joel Santana, Dipset all day, every day, holding it down. Big shout out to Cheddar, and welcome y'all to Harlem. About to go through my store. Let's check it out, see Santana's town, see how we do it. Hey, I'll let you for it. I respect the hood and the hood respects me and that's the type of love you get. Switch up your melody, you hot, but if you go pop, your record will be selling. And when you're that type of person, that just how it goes down. That's not good to me. And if that can't cut it, fuck it, drop me, watch me, blow up on another label, I'm cop. Actually, when I first got to Santana's Town store, it was um, on another location. We just moved to this location. It was on 151st and um, Amsterdam. That's like where I currently hang out. That's really like the hangout where we hang out the block, you know what I'm saying? But this was actually a bigger location, you know what I'm saying? So we had to move. It's only a couple of blocks away. This is 150th in between 150th and 149th in Amsterdam, right across the street. So we had to move to a bigger location because. It was just getting big, I mean, a lot of people was coming in, cop and stuff, I mean, so we had to expand the business, you know what I mean? And that's where we at right now, but we still in the hood, we only about a block away from from where I really used to be at, you know what I'm saying? Well, that's what it is, it's all love. Of course, what would be what would be a, a, a Harlem store without regular white t-shirts? You know, Harlem, all day, every day. It, it wouldn't even make no sense. Any store, matter of fact, any store, if you own a Chinese restaurant, you should start investing in... In, in, in white tees. If you own a bodega, you should start investing in white tees. Whatever you own, invest in white tees. In Dutch masters. You know, a lot of people, I don't be liking the way they be folding their bandanas. So I'm gonna have to show y'all right here, because it's an art to this, for real. Like, people think you could just put this joint on and just, you know what I'm saying? But your bandana can't just be tight like this when you put it on. You see how it's tight like this when I put it on? You gotta pull it to the side and pull it and loosen it. You know what I'm saying? Now you rocking a bandana, right? You see that? You see what I'm saying? That was just for you. A lot of people don't get that right there, Cheddar. Like, for real. Now I'm gonna give you this so I can leave with that, too. I'm better than half you. Rappers who have to. Rap cause you broke, man. I rap cause I'm that dude. Human crack. That's true. The definition of rap in a capsule. Me. That's who labeled the class kidder, labeled the crack dealer. Now look, I'm stable and labeled that nigga. I'm about my mail. You ain't got my mail? Dead dad, his head crack like a lobster tail. Let go the chrome for I exo your dome. You ain't gangster, you play Rambo like Sylvester Stallone. You guys are laugh at you, the nine Mac a clap at you. It'll feel like a linebacker tackled you, the game back in circus mode. Bunch of clowns in love, man. Y'all wines well go work for hoses. Dip set you people, respect the eagle. Or your chest will get wet and left see through. Boy, when they bust the thing, boy, when they dump the thing, it'll sound like Dr. Dre on the drum machine. Hey! You see, we good out here. Jewels out, this is a hundred thousand right here. You know what I'm saying? We out, just like that. Shout out to my man Aviani's right here. He gave me this. Yes. And now for me telling you he gave me this, he's gonna give me another one. Thank you for even asking about this watch right here. <laughs> yeah, I'll be out of here. As far as like my music, like it's really just stepped up a whole nother lot. Not just me having my own studio. Like I've been able to just work experimental on, on, on stuff like I probably would have never did before. Coming out the pocket, paying for a studio, you're more conscious about your music. So. Like, I feel like my whole music aspect this time around is like up to here right now. Like I'm comfortable, I'm more than comfortable with what I'm doing. I got over a hundred and something songs done. You know what I'm saying? So I'm happy. I'm just ready to put the album out. You know what I'm saying? I got the mixtape out. The Killing the Streets, the more crap. The mic check record. You know what I'm saying? It's got added to Hot 97 without the support of no label. That's all me, my man Ray, and my man Garnett. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just doing what I gotta do to make it happen. Cause I feel like I know I'm. I'm at, I don't feel. I know I'm that nigga, and I know I'm gonna do it big when the chance comes. So I might as well take the chance right now while I got the opportunity.
But like my mixtapes, people don't know. I sat in my studio with my dudes and sat there. I got eight brothers in my studio, CD burners. And I burn my own mixtapes. You know I'm saying we sit there and we burn them. We master them right there in the room. Then we go in the next room and we burn them joints. We get the covers. We sit in there and put my covers. Me, I do this hands-on training, baby, right here. I'm telling y'all. I put them joints in. I bring them to the stores myself. I go to Two Fifth, up and down, ask them at Hall of Music Hut. I bring my CDs in there. Joel Santana. You know what I'm saying? So. That's pretty much what it is. I mean, like, I'm just on my grind. Like, I still ain't got nothing, cause I see what, what it paid off when I was when I was like, I ain't gonna front. Like, I was I was always working. You know what I'm saying, and and it paid off by just me working. Now I'm working extra hard, so I'm just looking at it like this is just gonna pay off even more. That's just how I look at it. You know what I'm saying, hey yo, I pitch on blocks. I sit on blocks. I'm the shit you're not. No shit you're a lot. Holmes, the clip in the fifth and the fifth on cock. Say something in the fifth form pop, pop. I kid y'all not. I ain't no joke. I ain't no game. Won't you lames go kick on rocks? I'm used to the good coke. I'm used to the bad coke. I'm used to using a tool to get through to these assholes. I'm used to receiving a numerous cash flow, numerous bad hoes. Yeah, moving they ass slow. I'm a pimp and a boss, not a chump and a follower. You forgot? Well, guess what? I'm the one that's reminding you. You got real people everywhere. You got fly people everywhere. You got people who want to emulate that everywhere in all races, all backgrounds. So that's what we represent. Real and fly, man. And powerful music. We don't be rapping no bullshit like a lot of you, you know what I mean? Like you hear us, you feel us. You know what I mean? You don't just hear us and hear us. You hear us and feel us. And that, that's one thing Diplomats got that everybody else doesn't have. Not some other people don't have. Everybody doesn't have it.